Okay, I'm back after many computer problems and uh, many net issues, which has been the main uh, reason why I haven't been able to make any videos because I haven't been able to upload any. Um, I've seen a few of your questions uh, since I've been away, so I'll try and get around to them when I can. Uh, but there's so much, uh, there's lots and lots of videos I want to do and there's some great questions while I've been away. But this one here, um came in from someone saying i'm getting hard times trying to position the navbar absolute on my page which won't display properly on a small screen any idea and and this is in actually in a bootstrap okay so this is the um what you see and um yeah i mean <laughs> could be 101 things why navigation doesn't work but one thing about it is that there can be very few designers out there or developers that's never had trouble with menus and navigation and stuff it's it's very very common anyway so i can only you know surmise because i haven't seen the code if i saw the code it would be easy but anyway this is what i presume has happened um and what you would say there is on here on the right hand side is you've got a responsive visibility so if we just um if I can just go in there. Um, oh, I can't even remember me buttons that I'm supposed to go in with the zoom thing. Anyway, responsive visibility. Okay, so here we have the, um, you know, the large, your middle uh, devices, small and extra small for smartphones, as the Americans would say, cell phones. Anyway, so you could put in, for some reason, it could have happened where the large... Uh, the middle, say for example, computers, large, I would presume that's for televisions, etc. Small things like tablets, and the other one though doesn't have a checkbox. Okay, um, responsivism. Do, 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 do. Yeah, so, or have I done that the other way around? Yeah, I've done that the wrong way around. So, hidden extra small, which is a smartphone slash cell phone, is maybe it's ticked so if you're going to responsive visibility that could be an issue um, and so what basically would happen under them circumstances is you would see on here the large thing and you still see your menu you still see your menu and again in tablet form or phablet and here smart you don't see a thing okay so that would look like something on here um again on edge and so you would if once you start to go down there you are so there's your normal uh laptop or wherever and there we start to go into tablet which is still fine and now we're starting to go into a, a large phone and no mobile phone there okay so the easy trick of course for this is just to uncheck that box there so that would uh <coughs> <coughs> sorry and uh and then you would say your thing so there there now it would look like this you now you have your brand and your menus there so that that is one way of doing it it's probably something that's happened you sometimes you just check a box by accident you kind of get the thing back that that could be the uh, the reason and it's an easy solve however if it's not that there could be something like it's just getting out of maybe a column or a row or something like that and what i would do in them circumstances uh and it's easy sometimes when you for example copying and pasting um it's very very simple to um get away from you know it just gets out you know everything gets all mushy and uh, wrong code and all the rest of it anything can happen like that anyway what i would do is just put row in here okay so i'll just put a row in all right and i would just uh convert to html edit code okay so now that is the for the row and up the top there what i would do with that is convert to html edit code okay uh, so what I would do there is I would um, just move this along so everybody can see. All right. Okay. So there's your thing. You just 
Control C because um, I don't know if it's in the new version, but Bootstrap Studio doesn't like the right click for copying and pasting, which drives me batty. Um, and then the next one. So you've gone from your navigation code, okay, your custom code on there, and now you're going into your row. All right, so this is your row, and all you would do there is Control V, okay, apply it. So you're just applying it there. Okay, so now all that is in the uh, the row. So what you would have there is we just take that one, delete the top one, okay, and now we we're just going to preview it in the browser, and we'll see if this goes right the way down, right the way through the. There you are. So everything works fine. It goes right across the uh, the board where devices are concerned so that's the that's the way really to do that again any questions if if you uh if that still doesn't work for you just give us your code and i'll sort it out for you um other things that i've been doing is i'll put them in the description i've actually been doing some css animations for you to have a look at and i've also been changing my uh, own site so now i've had an opportunity to actually put some stuff up um it's there on the web but again I've, uh, I've, um, I think things are a bit better as regards on that, so hopefully I'll be able to make some more videos. So again, thank you for watching and thank you for listening.